Chair recognizes Ms. Decker of Cambridge. Thank you, Mr. Speaker, Chairman Dempsey, and Chairwoman Peisch. I rise today in support of the Consolidate Amendment. A civil society and, sex and successful communities really depend on all of us participating fully in society. And they really expect all of us to bring the best of our abilities. Investing in early childhood education ensures that children, no matter where they're born in this world or in this life, or what their incomes are, what their family makeups are, investing in early education means that we have the opportunity to really maximize the potential of children, of who they will be in this world today and who they will be in the future. We know through years of research that the first five years of life are critical to understanding the success children will have not only today, but later in life. As the mom of a two and a four year old, I am in constant awe of my children. I'm in awe of their laughter. I'm in awe of their tantrums, of the learning that is going on every day, their ability to problem solve, their ability to negotiate and understand what this world's about, and sometimes winning negotiations with me. I want this for all children. Today, we are investing uh, again in universal pre-kindergarten. And that means that we're ensuring children, some of our most vulnerable babies and toddlers, whose lives are living on the margins, investing in this program today means that we're giving them those same opportunities to fulfill their potential in this world and make this a better world for all of us. Mr. Speaker, I am so proud of the investments that we are making and the opportunity that you are offering the Commonwealth with this task force on early childhood education. What we are saying is we believe in the future of all children in Massachusetts. We understand that their success is our success. Who we are as a society really depends on who they will become. And so, Mr. Speaker, I rise in support of this amendment, and I say it once again, thank you for your leadership, thank you to Chairman Dempsey, and thank you to Chairwoman Peisch. Roll call having been ordered, roll call be called forthwith and will remain open for two minutes.